This is the last video in a series of 10 videos about database fundamental. This video will present questions about terms and about data models and the answers are not provided but you should know the answers based on your understanding of the terms and the uh, implementation of a data model to an actual database that we covered in previous videos. So what is the data model term that has this definition? A person, place, thing, or event about which we want to keep information. What are we referring to when we say we have a person, place, thing, or event about which we need to keep information? And what is a field called if it is used to link to a primary key field in another table? A field or fields that uniquely identify each row in a table is called what? If a relationship in the data model has a maximum cardinality of 1 on one end and crow's feet on the other end, what type of relationship is this? Which of the following could be a primary key for the employee table? EF Cod proposed the principles for databases, for what type of database, which is the type of database most widely used today. An attribute that might have more than one value for each entity, each entity blank, what would go there, is called a blank attribute. Now let's look at some data models and see if you can answer the questions. In the data model shown, how many tables would you actually build in the database? Which of these would get a foreign key? Customer, order, inventory, none of them would, all of them would. In the data model shown, how many tables would you build in the database? Which of these would get a foreign key? Employee, assignment, project, none of these would, all of these would. In the data model shown here, how many tables would you actually build in the database based on this model? In the data model shown below, which of these would get a foreign key? Vendor, part, bill of materials, none of these would, all of these would. So how do you think you did? If you can't answer all these questions, you can go back and review the videos about database fundamentals. If you work with relational databases, the concepts, terms, for modeling and database design presented in this set of videos is very important.